now it's time for some alone time with Batman. Oh, no one can tell what I'm saying. Oh. So, Ben, in Batman Arkham Origins, Batman's fighting for his life, but also he needs a shave, doesn't he? Well, needs a shave. I don't know. I think he looks pretty dashing, really. I wish I could grow some stubble like that. I think stubble is a good look. So, <laughs> so tell me about the story. He's younger this time, yeah? Yeah, so it's it's about year two, exactly how old he is. I mean, what does that mean in Batman years, right? But it's year two of his career, um, and uh, he's not quite the refined Batman that we see in Asylum and City. He's a younger, rawer Batman, and uh, he's not really faced the kinds of challenges that really define him. He hasn't faced the sort of major members of the rogues gallery. Uh, up until this point in his career, it's mostly been thugs and pimps and drug dealers and that kind of thing. But on, on our, in our game, that all changes. It's Christmas Eve, a very, very important night. Black Mask, who's the number one crime lord in all of Gotham, puts a $50 million bounty on Batman's head one night to kill the bat. This, of course, attracts the eight top assassins in the DC universe. They bring their gangs, their gangs tear the city apart, and Batman has to defeat all the assassins, survive their assassination attempts, clean up the crime spree that's tearing through the city, try and bring Black Mask to justice all in one night, and it's a kind of challenge that sets him on a whole new path, the path to become the Dark Knight. I tell you what, with a $50 million bounty, I think I'll be there as well having a good go. Well, it's funny you should say that because it doesn't necessarily stop at the assassins. I'm not going to say any more than that, but you're right. At $50 million, you know, there are other people who want a piece of that pie. Interesting. Now, some of these assassins, of course, we've heard of them before and we've yep. seen them, but Batman hasn't necessarily met them before. Yeah, no, that's a great point. Um, Batman Arkham Origins. What is this an origin story about? Well, it's the origins of the relationships nice of between these in. key characters. Case in point being Captain Captain Gordon, right? Um, he's the head of the GCPD, a super corrupt police force. Batman and the police are not friends. They're not cool homies who like to hang out at this point in time in the series. And so that relationship between Gordon and Batman has some tension that needs to be worked out as well. Another new aspect of the game is the case file system where yes. you reconstruct and deconstruct yep. crime scenes. Yes. That looks pretty special. Where did that idea come from? Wow, where did that idea come from? Um, two people on, on my team who really deserve a ton of credit. Um, one of them is actually here, uh, Matthew Kedai is our uh, lead gameplay programmer and Dave Shannon who's not here unfortunately is our lead ga uh, senior game designer and way back when the two of them were brainstorming on just what can we do what can we do to make something more awesome and they were at that time watching a lot of Sherlock the BBC version of Sherlock and CSI obviously and were recognizing that the fantasy of being the world's greatest detective was perhaps a little underserved in the Arkham games and they started playing with this idea of digitally recreating crime scenes and the rest is history. I mean, we absolutely love that feature. We've got a bunch of crime scenes spread out in the world. We think some people will just play with it, like just as a tool, you know, just a sandbox, walking around, rewinding, fast forwarding, watching the bodies go flying in slow motion, rewinding it back. Great, well I know you've only uncovered just a couple of the features in the game and I look forward to seeing the other features uh, before it's out in October, when's it out? So it ships worldwide October 25th. Um, four main platforms, the PlayStation 3, Xbox 360, PC and Wii U. There's also the companion game, Batman Arkham Origins Blackgate. Um, that is on the Nintendo 3DS and the PlayStation Vita. Awesome. I'm going to be playing it on the consoles and on the move. I can't wait, Ben. Thank you. Cool. Thank you very much. So there you go. Can't wait for that one. GamesWeasel.com